Hello, my name is Stacy. I'm going to teach you a simple walking meditation. I'm here at a company in an empty conference room where I just taught a weekly yoga class at a pharmaceutical company. And I sometimes teach this to my yoga students at companies or for seniors because it's very useful for people who are new to meditation. This might be in your case, but you don't want to sit in the stillness. The mind's too busy. The body's uncomfortable. Well, guess what? There's so many ways you can meditate. This is a wonderful technique. It's basically just slow, slow walking with mindfulness and breath awareness. It's not like exercise, although you'll get some benefits to the moving the joints, getting some circulation through the body, helping perhaps prevent falls from placement of the foot awareness, and it could even help with balance. But the real benefit is calming for the mind. So begin by picking a hand position, either interlock the fingers in front of you, you can hold your wrists behind you, or just let your arms relax alongside you. And then you're simply gonna slow your walking down. Look down on the ground, eyes always open, either look in front or on the ground. You're gonna roll heel to toe slow with awareness. As you slow the walking movement down, feel every part of your foot as it touches the ground. You can do this in shoes, barefoot or outside is, is preferable as well for fresh air. As you slow your walking movement down, start to notice the breath. Just like sitting meditation, when you lose awareness of breath or the footsteps, that's just probably because your mind got distracted and you drifted off. So just bring it back to the breath or footsteps when you notice. It's just training the mind to be present, relaxed, focusing, aware of breath and body. There's one more step you can do for med meditation when walking. You can sink your breath to the movement. After noticing footsteps and the breath, for example, you can sink the breath, like inhale, right heel, and then toes down. Exhale, left heel, toes down. So inhale one foot down, exhale the other foot. I'm just walking in circles for the sake of, you can see me in the video, but you can use whatever space you have inside or out. No set pattern to walk or breathe. Go at your own pace. You can also inhale right foot down, exhale left foot down to go a little faster. Whichever hand position you pick, try to keep that the whole time so you're not fidgeting, but there's no right or wrong. You'll notice the slower you walk, the harder for balance. If you need support, you can bring your hand on a wall or just go a little faster. Make it enjoyable, maybe set a timer five or 10 minutes, build up to 30 minutes. You can also do walking meditation five or 10 minutes and that might lead you to then be able to sit quietly cross-legged on the floor or in a chair to then with eyes closed watch the breath or perhaps use a mantra. So walking meditation can also lead you to silent meditation sitting where at first you might feel antsy or the body uncomfortable or the mind too busy or stressed and not want to sit. But after 5, 10, 20 minutes walking meditation you prepare the mind and body to perhaps want to enjoy stillness sitting quietly which will then have an even more profound effect for the mind as it calms the nervous system, brings clarity, can help you sleep better, and brings you more peace. So I hope you enjoy this one of many techniques of walking meditation for yourself. If you're a yoga teacher, you may enjoy trying this out with your classes. I teach this sometimes for my chair yoga classes for seniors as I teach it in my chair yoga teacher training as well, where even students can hold the chair for support as they walk around. And there's many ways to do it. Most important, you're enjoying and trying to meditate or do yoga every day to receive the benefit. Have a great day. Namaste.